Hey Georgetown, I'm Aliha, I'm a senior at SFS and today I'm going to give you a tour of the dorms at Georgetown's Qatar campus. We have separate male and female dorms and the female dorms are called Shamali where I live while the male dorms are called Janubi. This is the dorm entrance where we have a waiting area and some small exhibitions. This is the dining area for all the students but you can also bring your friends from outside if you want to hang out and have food. We have a buffet and a menu that you can order from. So this is the entrance to the actual dorms and you need to have a card access to it. On the ground floor we have this beautiful lounge area where you can hang out with your friends. My dorm is on the first floor so we take the stairs. So I live in the residential hall where most of the freshmen and sophomore live. But since I was made the RA last year, I had to move from my apartment to the residential hall. Residential hall rooms are single person rooms. We have our own bathrooms and share a common floor kitchen. This is what I like to call my kitchen area because we have a small pantry here and a mini fridge. So my bed has some interesting features. The headboard is also an LED light and it has a built-in speaker. We also have a TV but I don't really use it that much. So these are our attached bathrooms and each student gets their own bathrooms with things like built-in hair dryers. We also have our own showers with hot and cold water running 24-7. Finally, we have two spacious cupboards and we have some other storage like these drawers. The dustbins and all the furniture here is detachable so you can put them anywhere on the wall. Right outside my room is a small common area where you can study or hang out with your friends. And this is the common kitchen. We have a common fridge, microwave, toaster and a kettle and some seating area. In addition to the kitchen, we also have some common areas where you can hang out or study and we also have some dedicated study rooms. On the second floor of the dorms, we have our laundry room that is shared by the entire building. We also have a common courtyard between all the buildings. Most of the seniors and juniors live in apartment buildings like these. So there are three types of apartment. One is a studio apartment, uh, a two bedroom apartment where you share a kitchen between two people, and finally a one bedroom apartment. We are going to my friend's one bedroom apartment right now. Um, I personally have lived in a studio apartment and a shared apartment before this, and I loved living there. In the apartment, there is a common area with a couch and a TV and some other built in storage. It also has a kitchen that comes with things like cooking plate, refrigerator, a microwave, kettle, and a toaster and most importantly, a dishwasher. There is a separate room with spacious bed and yet another TV. That was all from my side. Thank you so much for joining me. See you next time.